friends. Hope you're doing well today. You woke up, right? So you're doing well. You're breathing and you're seeing stuff. You're doing well. <laughs> Or at least I hope so. But today, what are we doing? So if you, if you guys saw my, my other video with this new deck that I'm using right now, I'm still playing with it. It's working pretty well for us. It's 3.4, which isn't too bad. There's no deep, well, yeah. I was just about to say there's no defense in it. For some reason, my mind doesn't view spawners as defenses because you kind of use them offensively. But as the building structure, it is used as a defense, obviously. Um, <clears throat> but, well, actually, I guess not because it's a building, so... Who knows? <laughs> um, okay, that was a weird start to the video. But what are we doing here, guys? I'm going to show you all a replay real quick. Okay, so just... I've been seeing a lot of um, mortar cycle decks. A lot of mortar cycle decks. And if you're not ready for them, they can crush you because they've got the rocket in there. So really, they can just defend and just cycle their rocket. Um, so I'm going to kind of show you all how I dealt with a mortar deck in this, um, in this battle right here. We absolutely dominated it. Um, it went really, really well. One thing that you guys need to know is their deck cycles very, very quickly. So you need to make sure that you have Elixir to defend with or at least to distract um, the Mortar. He's going to use his rocket right here. He's down to practically nothing. So I'm going to send my Miner over there just to get some chip damage done um, on that Mortar, uh, which obviously wasn't the best, but he's still fairly low on his Elixir. Um, and I am going to be able to uh, cycle through here and, and wait for him. But if you have a tank in your deck, you need to always try and save up for that because it'll distract the mortar. It'll distract the mortar for almost the mortar's entire life. Um, so for me here, guys, my P.E.K.K.A. is going to be used as a defense. My P.E.K.K.A. is going to use to take out the knight. My P.E.K.K.A. is going to use to distract the mortar. My P.E.K.K.A. is going to be used um, to hopefully get to the tower, but I don't think that it's ever going to. Um, and other than that, my P.E.K.K.A. is not really going to be used for, for that much at all because it's not going to be able to do much for me. So I'm going to send my miner over here as the P.E.K.K.A. is distracting. So right now the miner is just going to get good chip damage done. That's his whole point right here is to get some good chip damage done. Um, my musketeer is going to come over. She's going to do a little bit of damage. And as you can see, we've already got his tower down to 2347 guys um so the biggest thing like right here once again we got to get our pekka down i have to get my pekka down to distract the building the um furnace there still would have been fine i think it might have targeted the tower i'm not too sure um which one would have come out closer for it um but we i arrow this for some no i don't okay i ended up not arrowing it i thought i did i, I do waste my arrows a couple times in this um but the mortar right there actually got off a shot. I didn't even recognize that while I was playing because once the P.E.K.K.A. gets too close, it's going to get off a shot. He's going to drop off his um, Knight, which is going to get hit by the P.E.K.K.A. So now his biggest tank, his biggest thing that distracts for the mortar is already almost dead. Um, so we're going to be able to send in our Miner here. He's going to drop off his mortar again. But look at this. Our, um, our, um, our Miner is going to distract his mortar um, as the P.E.K.K.A. or as the Musketeer does work over here. And then our P.E.K.K.A. is going to come in once again, doing work, shutting things down. I send over the Electro Wizard. It probably wasn't the best call right there. Um, I arrow those just because I wanted that Fire Spirit to do what it did right there. And we send our Miner over one more time. I'm just trying to keep his cycle messed up. So he's going to drop this off. We're going to go ahead and drop off our Musketeer um, as, or an Ice Spirit over here. Then the P.E.K.K.A. to distract. Now we're going to get down our Musketeer, um, I believe, or my Furnace. Yeah, so Musketeer is down. Musketeer is going to take out that Mortar super quick. This is where I arrow, and I guess it wasn't a bad arrow because there were still three um, skeletons left, which distract the P.E.K.K.A. extremely well. Our P.E.K.K.A. is tanking for our Miner once again, guys, and what are we going to do now that we're getting it so low and it's already overtime? I'm going to go ahead and send my other Miner back here as our Musketeer is right here and as our Furnace is still distracting um, for us. That Ice Spirit's going to come in right there. I'm going to arrow just just to get some more damage done on his tower. Now he's freaking out. He's got to start rocket cycling, even though his tower is down to 444. At this point, I have to switch up my location of my miner every time we end up taking him out. Give him a good game there right at the end, guys. And you can see all the damage that was done, I believe, was one mortar shot and then a couple of rockets. So you got to be really, really careful. You can't sit back too long. You can't just wait for a draw against a mortar deck. That's why they have the rocket in there, because the rocket can be cycled, and, and they can end up just doing work, taking out your defenses, etc., etc. But we're going to keep on playing with this deck. It's working well for me. It is a lot of fun, um, and uh, I like it. I like it. I feel like I know this guy's name, Loki, um, from somewhere, but I don't know if it's anybody special or not. The name just looks... A little bit um, familiar but um, yeah I hope you guys are doing well today um, it's it's a new day it's a new dawn it's a new day and uh, I don't know new days make me happy um, let's go ahead and drop off our musketeer right here to do some work 
on all these things. Um, and we've got a minor deck as well. What did I do over there? Why, why does his tower already have damage on it? I literally don't even remember. Send this over. Send this. Oh, it was from the fire spirits. Um, he's going to go and do that and actually knock our musketeer back. So thank you for doing that. Now the musketeer is going to not be targeted by the tower. And a lot of damage is going to be done <laughs> because of that log. Look at that, guys. Woo! What? Yes, sir. -ry. That's what I like to see. We'll go ahead and drop off our Electro Wizard a little bit early right there. Um, I could have been played a little bit better. Um, but again, not too shabby. Let's go ahead and drop this off. Um, Pekka, I probably shouldn't use... Oh, man. Well, that's fine. Why? Yeah, because... Oh, no. Dang it. I was about to say, our Electro Wizard is going to do some work there. Um, we need to be careful here. I might need to mirror my um, arrows. <clears throat> do we need to? No. All right, so I need to play very, very smart here, guys, because I have the upper hand completely. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and drop off my furnace as well. Um, and we've got an Ice Spirit also uh, to hopefully stop them, which is what I wanted it to do. Thank you, Ice Spirit. I'm going to send this back over here. Um, his furnace is going to get distracted by it, which is good because they're going to waste themselves. And our miner is going to... Is he going to take out that tower, guys? Woo! Look at that. There we go. All right, go ahead and drop off your uh, Goblin Gang, please. I'm just going to go here, um, distract that one in the back, and there we go. So they, he got off a little bit of damage. That's okay. We've got our arrows ready. Um, he's going to fireball. Missed. Really, he hit everything? Well, I don't know about that, but okay. Um, go ahead and go down right here um, and arrow all this. Boom. Yes, that was a good arrow. And then we are going to drop off. Uh, okay, come on, <laughs> Pekka. Why'd you take so freaking long? Go ahead and send our miner over um, to take this out. And uh, this and this. Boom and boom. He's only going to take out one of them. He took out two. Nice. Go ahead and arrow this as well um, and keep our Pekka up for a little bit longer. Um, he's just cycling stuff right now. Uh, as you can see, he's, he's, he's freaking out. He's cycling so much. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get all this down over here as well. Let's send our P.E.K.K.A. in um, as he does. Oh, no, please, 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 please. Yes. Yes, Electro Wizard. Oh, my goodness. That's beautiful. Um, okay, so we've got that. Where are my arrows at? I'm keeping my arrows ready um, just in case he goes. Okay, so he's going to fireball. Where's your minion horde at? Where's your minion horde at? Where's your minion horde at? Oh, nope. Okay. Nice. We were about to get a three anyways. He was just going for it. Coming back with that W, with that win, ladies and gentlemen. And I do believe that that might be 10 wins in a row with this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight wins, right? One, two, three. Uh-oh. <laughs> Why is it so... Oh, didn't mean to do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight wins. Let's see if we can get ourselves 10 wins with this deck, guys, without losing. It's working well. I really, really like this one. Um... And it's not like it's not a zap bait deck at any rate. Um, the miner does well in it. He's more of a, of a chipper in this deck. Um, and the Pekka is used as a defense and then sometimes an offense if I can get her there. Um, let's go ahead and send over our miner right here as well as our electro wizard. And we'll get our arrows ready just in Okay, nope, that's not going to do anything for us. So that could have been played a lot better. Let's arrow this as well. Um, and honestly, that should take it all out. Two, three, one, two. His Mega Minion is going to get off like three shots, which is going to not be good. Please only get off one. Okay, that was good. Um, I don't know if those air. Okay, yep. So look, now is when we go Pekka. He's going to try and defend one and two and three shots. Don't give him another one. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Royal Giant deck. That's okay. Let's get there, Pekka. Come on, Pekka. Let's get there. Let's get there, Pekka. Let's get there. One, two, we're gonna send this in. Get our miner there before our musketeer crosses the bridge. That's beautiful. And he's going to use a lot of elixir right there. We're gonna get this down. Um, and honestly, I need to get down a, I need to get down my furnace really bad. Um, let's go right here and they will go over and hopefully do some, oh my gosh, it only targeted the, the side one. Crap. <sighs> Come on, kill it. <laughs> do something here, let's go. Let's go. Let's keep this rolling here. Um, all right. Here's his RG once again. I'm going to go Pekka right over here um, to take him out and then to work on our side. I really need double elixir right here, like very, very badly. Um, but obviously, we're not going to get that. And we are going to have to try and do something. Come on, Pekka. Please get there. Pekka, please get there. 
One, two. Now we're gonna send our miner over and he is going to go down with his barbarian. So I'm gonna go double miner. I know that might seem a little bit ridiculous, um, but I think that we will be able to take out the tower with it. Um, I'm gonna go right here with this. His tower is gonna go down right there. And um, we're gonna go musketeer right here. His barbs are gonna do a lot of work to us. Let's go miner right here um, as well. Look at that, look at that RG just, just, just having, a, having a ball. Having a ball, oh my gosh. It's so bad. It's so freaking bad. All right, so Pekka's gonna do some work right here. Um, I have to get down. Ah, oh, there he goes. All right, that's gonna be game. Um, dang it, guys! I really wanted to get ten wins. Honestly, our cycle just wasn't right. Um, we didn't have the furnace down whenever he had. Uh, whenever he had barbarians come out, we weren't ready for it. Um, but hey, that happens. Eight wins in a row is still really, really good. Look at that electro was doing work there, and look at this. This right here would have been it. Uh, coming back after him um, So what are we gonna do here? Uh, I want to jump back into it eight and one with this deck. That's not too shabby guys especially losing to um, That RG again. I think that the problem there was that we didn't have our furnace down to um, Help with the push against the um, Barbarians because if we'd had our furnace down then I think that we would have been uh, doing fairly well So we're playing Royale con queso. This is uh, Alvaro's professional team um, so we'll see how we do. Might be running into an RG here. Nope. Okay, so no RG uh, here. We are going to be seeing uh, the mortar. So all we have to do is try and play the same way that we played before, guys. Um, just letting his thing do, like, have fun. Have fun with that. That's, that's okay. You do that. We'll leave that right there. And uh, the mortar is just going to be wasted right there as well. Um, so we'll see what happens. Electro Wizard, oh my goodness. Is this a joke? Huh? Is this a joke? That's wildly unfortunate. Go ahead, drop this off, and let's get a, um... I'm gonna go Musketeer back here just to help this out. And we'll let that RG do his thing. What's he gonna do here? Alright, cool, yep, do work. Nice, sending our Miner over there as well. And come on, Musketeer, stay alive, stay alive. Come on, Miner is on the tower. Electro Wizard is gonna do some work on that other tower. Pekka's there, guys. Dunzo. Done. Zo, do some tanking for me, Miner. I appreciate it. Pekka's gonna get to the tower. Musketeer's staying alive. And that tower might just go down with a sexy three crown. Ladies and gentlemen, against Royale Con Queso. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I know. It, it, wait, hey. It was sexy. Okay? Don't tell me that. It, you guys remember that stage in YouTube <laughs> where all the thumbnails were like, Sexy archers, and it's like what? I'm uh, sorry, what? Archers? What are you talking about? Sexy Valkyrie gameplay? I'm like what? No, that was, I, I'm happy those days are behind us. All right, let's jump into another match here, and uh, see what we can have. I think this is one of our first level 13s that we're playing as we use this deck, guys. Um, Electro Wizard still working strong for us. Uh, I haven't used the Electro Wizard that much, so um, I'm excited to be learning. Excuse me, I'm excited to be learning about it. So we've got our P.E.K.K.A. ready here. Not too sure what he's gonna bring at us. Um, hopefully this Ice Spirit will go down. It will. Let's go ahead and just send this over here um, and see if we can get ourselves some damage done. I'm gonna arrow this also. And, oh, that was almost really good. That was almost really good. All that should go down as well. Um, again, we don't know what he has quite yet. Um, so I am gonna go ahead and put my furnace out here. Just in case we need to distract something that isn't an RG. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. The one, the only. Royale Giant. Poof! Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Alright, here's a question for you. And I really want y'all to do this for me. Comment down below. How do you spell the sound that the Royal Giant makes? Huh? How do you spell it? Ice Spirit right there. I'm gonna send my Miner in here on this princess. He's gonna drop off some guards. Uh, that are gonna do work right there, but look at this. We should be, oh, get their fire spirits. Get their fire spirits, come on. Yes, Woo! Get there, Pekka. You're beautiful, I love you. Oh, yes. <laughs> there she is. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. Doing work against Mr. RG. Um, sad thing is I didn't put that in a good spot, that furnace right there, but it did go and, it did go and take out the minions, so that's fine. Um, I am going to, wait just a second here. And go ahead and throw this now. 
Um, and these fire spirits will get there to whatever it is. Again, guys, the P.E.K.K.A. is a great defense against the Royal Giant. He works, or she works so, I'm, I'm sorry, P.E.K.K.A. I didn't mean to call you a he. Oh, crap. Right, so he's going to go right there. That's totally fine uh, because we'll go ahead and go uh, P.E.K.K.A. right here. And we'll go ahead and get down um, an ice spirit. She's going to take that out. We're going to go minor over here. And I'm going to be like, hey, buddy, what you going to do about that, huh? What you going to do about all that? Oh, no. Didn't think that was going to be coming. That's no good. Uh, he's going to get off a lot of damage right here. But the musketeer is going to do some work. Hopefully this P.E.K.K.A. gets to that tower. He's Look at that. He wasted that fireball. P.E.K.K.A. is going to get on that tower. We're going to go ahead and arrow all this as well. Um and see what we have happen here. What are you gonna do, my dear friend? He's got to go for this, for this, uh, for this other one over here. Um, Ice Spear is gonna do some work on that as well. And now we'll go ahead and I'm gonna go right here with this. There he goes, because he's really, really wanting, um, he's really, really wanting his uh, his elite barbs to probably end up taking that out. We need to get some fire spirits on those minions. I really don't want to waste my elixir on that because we don't need to. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and defend over here, and we'll go ahead and throw our miner down, as I was about to. And we take it out. And we take it out. That's what, you know, let's play one more. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not messing around. I'm not messing around, okay? <laughs> We're having fun. Opening up two crown chests, or, uh, yeah, two crown chests today already. And now we're up over 4,900. Let's jump into another one. I'm liking this deck, guys. Now, here's the thing. I haven't faced Lava Loon with it, which I want to, because that's, Lava Loon is super strong. Um, and I don't know how this will work. I really don't. I feel like it could work very well um, because it's got the Electro Wizard in it. It's got the Musketeer. We have the power to. Um, we have the power to, if we want to, to mirror the Electro Wizard or mirror the um, or mirror the Musketeer. Let's go ahead and send this in here, and we're gonna go straight Miner. Boom, boom, boom. Bip, bap, bap. There we go. Sending that Miner over. Um, and hopefully we can get our P.E.K.K.A. down. I'm just going to save up a little bit here. Our Musketeer is going to go down. But honestly, with all of this that's coming, we should be good to go here. Um, let's get our P.E.K.K.A. down on the Musketeer first in the back. Boom! Taking her out. He logged, thinking we were going to drop off something. Oh, no! No, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, man. Dang it. Come on, Fire Spirits. Wow, that's okay. We defended well. Um, man, that was so close. That P.E.K.K.A. Ooh, I thought that P.E.K.K.A. was going to go after it. Um, now, here he comes with this again. We'll just go. Okay. All right. Yep. Cool. Okay. We'll go right there. Yep. And we'll go ahead and go Electro Wizard um, to hopefully uh, slow him down a good bit. Hope oh, he's going to hit both of them. And it's nice. He it didn't kill my Electro Wizard. Thank you. Thank you for not killing my Electro Wizard. Where is it? Mine are coming in. Let's go ahead and get uh, an Ice Spirit down just to help defend. And it's not going to defend as we wanted it to. Um, but look at this. We're getting nice. He has to defend that as well. I like this. We're doing good. We're doing good. Let that guy go ahead and live. Um, here we go. Right here. Let's get this rolling. Let's get this rolling. Um, only thing is we don't want him to distract our uh, our fire spirits. Here we go. Nice. This could this could be good. We'll go Musketeer right here, and we're gonna go Pekka right here. Yeah. See if we can get some fire spirits down. I'm gonna go ahead and just send my miner over as that Pekka starts to tank, and he's gonna go and fireball that, which was not a good fireball. Where's your minion horde at? Woo! Where's your minion horde at? I don't know, but it's too late. Arrows, get all of them. Yes. Wow, he tried, guys. He tried. His effort was valiant. We have another arrow to put down. And another P.E.K.K.A. to put right here. <laughs> well, I don't know why he's still, he's still logging. Like, we haven't used anything that a log would kill. Um, but I, oh, man. Oh, actually, I didn't even need to use this. And now that he used his thing right there, that's okay. I'm down with it. Throw something. It's not going to work. Got these arrows right here for you. Eight seconds. Coming at it. Guys, this deck is gorgeous. This deck is gorgeous. I love it. Try it out. Hope you guys do. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are the best. As always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on. And I'll see y'all in the next episode. What is that? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven and one with this deck. Not too shabby.
um, playing up here about to pass 5,000 and work our way on up. Maybe we'll get a new record with it. I don't know. But again, thank you so much, guys. I will see y'all in the next episode. All right. Peace.